for, the re for a reason. Well, McSorley is out there as well. Oh, McSorley slapped for sheer and caught him in the helmet. Wow. Donald Brashear is down and maybe out. I did not see that. Uh, it, 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 I see that Brashear is down. Well, debris being thrown on the ice now with 2.7 seconds. And Fred Snow has gone after McSorley. Boy, I tell you what the ugly part of this is, is what's being thrown on the ice. You know what? I had a feeling, Dave, with eight seconds left now. They brought the stretcher out for Brashear. He is still down and not moving. Yeah, he's moving his hand. But, I mean, I mean, was it Brashear's time up to be on the ice or what? I mean, he was out there. He took a, he skated four or five strides to make a hit in Hal Gill. And hopefully he's all right, but... Down at the other end, John Graham now has got a hold of Garth Snow. Well, it appears that Donald Brashear is bleeding from the nose. I don't know what Marty McSorley was thinking, Gary. Uh, in all honesty, I didn't see that. I was watching the puck in the corner. For some reason, I think Marty McSorley's been in a few jackpots here before playing with Edmonton and L.A. Let's go back and see this set, and we'll catch it. I think Mar Marty, in uh, all fairness, uh, he was trying to tap him on the shoulder. But, you know, you're very responsible for the, your stick. And this is not good, and it'll be, a, it'll be a, an unbelievable... Uh... Well, Marty went over and leaned over and said something to Brashear as he uh, was laying on the ice. I don't think it was, I hope you're okay.